What's up, everybody? It's just ginger ale. That's all. Just ginger ale. So yesterday we were successful at finally catching up with a video that was long overdue. Um, the unboxing of four of our latest new products, which you want to subscribe and go check that out because it kind of gives you a quick peek at um, our recent signature products of adult novelties to kings. Our first ones to be exact. So be sure to check that out. Also, don't forget at the end of this video, hang around, make sure you enter to win our grand prize giveaway. Now this video here was suggested after seeing yesterday's vid about the tool, like why you never did one on the Kings for your glass twisty blunts, which I'm gonna do, and it's gonna be short, real quick, tell you about it, show you how to work it, and then we're gonna be out of here, all right? And we're gonna get started right after this. Thanks for coming back. So what exactly is the King's Royal Glass Twisty Blunt? This is like the apex of the vortex of joint engineering. All right, I'll tell you what, I'll give you a real world scenario. So let's just say you're a chef, you entered into the International Bake Off in your town and you gotta transport your parsley flakes to the Bake Off and who wants to carry this big obtrusive container down there. No, 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 no. You're going to use King's Royal Glass Twisty Blunts. Now, I came out with these a few years back when I came out with my own line of shades and Bluetooth earphones. So, some of you, you're already familiar with this. And you, and you might even know how to use it, but for those of you who don't, this will be a treat. So, first of all, the packaging is nice. You see through the window. You can see the product through it. You see King's right there. Royal Glass Twisty Blunts. Nice packaging, right? All right, so we're gonna take an open one up so you can actually see just what it looks like. So I'm gonna rip this open half, yeah. nice and sealed tightly. Comes in a nice black foam. Got a little suede feel to it, you see? All right, there's your twisty blunt. Comes with a nice little brush right here too with it, see? I'm gonna show it to you. As well as a little cleaner pipe to clean out your twisty blood when it gets clogged with herbs. Okay, so today we're gonna to be talking about the parsley flakes for your Bake Off. Now, let's take out the twisty blunt itself because that's what we're here for, really. The accessories are nice, but hey, we're about the twisty blunt itself. Made out of nice gold tone brass. You know, the materials are definitely premium. And like you see up there, you see even on you got your kings on, see, right on the glass itself. So if you don't see that on it, it's not ours. All right, so let's set that to the side for a second. And let's say we got, let's take some uh, real life scenario. And again, we're gonna take our parsley, right? I'm just gonna use a sample of the parsley to simulate how you would load up your parsley. Um, yeah. Just a little bit like that. See, it's parsley, right? How we load your parsley up, right? So we take that uh -uh, and put it in your parsley grinder, right? And you slide it in just like so. All right, and then you take and put your cap on and you grind your parsley up because you don't want to bake with unground parsley, boom. Boom, you're good to go. Your parsley is nice and round. And there's where your King's Way Blast Twisty Bucks come in. Now these are made awesome just to keep your stuff nice and fresh. Pull it out. So it had a rubber stopper. That's why it was kind of tough to get it off. And it spirals. It spirals, it spirals. So what you would do next is take your parsley, right? And load it into your tube, right? 
of your king's royal glass twisty blood. And I'm a messy person, but I think that was a pretty good load. Now I didn't even load it all the way, but just enough for you to see it's loaded in there like so. And you take your spiral to insert it back. And what you're gonna do is you're gonna twist. See how I'm twisting? And what it's doing, it's loading. It's loading each spiral as I'm twisting it. And I'll do that until it's loaded each spiral all the way around. It's locked back down to where the rubber stopper meets and you're loaded, ready to go, ready to transport your parsley, okay, to your bake-off. So no one's gonna have fresher parsley than you. Now let's say you get to the parsley um, bake-off, right? Get to the bake-off and you're ready to use your parsley. So you take your rubber cap off that you were sealing in the freshness with, boom, and you dispense your parsley. Now you might want to light your parsley just to make sure it's going into your recipe nice and hot. And you do, you light the end, boom. Once your parsley gets a little ashed, you twist it. Look at this, look at this. You twist it and you twist out all the ashed out parsley and then you'll have another spiral of parsley to light, huh? And throw into your ingredients. Bottom line is, when you're finished, you can slap your rubber cap right back on and be good to go. So, if you're interested in grabbing you a Royal Glass Twisty Blunt, so you can transport your parsley to the countless number of bake-offs that you're in there, just hit me up. Make sure you're following us below all the different social media places. You can also grab yourself King's Royal Glass Twisty Blunt at kingsadultentainment.com, right? Or you can just hit me up personally. I place the orders myself, okay? I ship them out and I ship them out for you. All right, now, thanks for coming through once again. Right after this is how to enter grand prize giveaway don't forget to share this with some folks because if you don't win, maybe somebody else you know will win. Once we hit a thousand subscribers, that grand prize giveaway is going to be awarded to somebody random. And then we can get on to the rest of the grand prize giveaways because we got a ton of them. So, thanks for stopping through again. And I hope you enjoyed the how to on the Royal Glass Twisty Blunts. My kings, baby. I forgot, I forgot to say, it's a wrap. <laughs>